Hey guys, it's uh, me again. Oh, who else would it be? It's 7.14 in the morning. Everyone wants to sleep in. You might as well do it while you're in quarantine. Some interesting stuff happened though. So late last night I had to get out of bed, get dressed because someone came by and dropped off this form. This form is a COVID-19 consent to undergo testing. So I get tested today. They said sometime after 9 a.m. They will call me, I'll go up to the 14th floor and I'll stick swabs up my nose. Uh, so I have to fill this out, give them my consent, and then I also have to fill out this declaration for any guests that come to the hotel. Uh, there's a declaration form that you have to fill out. Um, questions such as, do you have any reason to believe you have or may have COVID-19? Things like that. Uh, it's still dark outside. Let's give you a look outside. Yep. Sun's coming up. So uh, that's all happening today. I'm just waiting. Uh, breakfast will be here in about 45 minutes and then uh, we'll get on with that. But that's the exciting thing that's happening today. Are you excited? Oh gosh, I'm excited. I shouldn't be excited. I'm nervous. I'm scared. I'm actually scared. I'm not excited. It's, nope, I'm not a slave to fear. Haha. <laughs> but seriously, I don't want it to happen. Real quick breakfast. Coffee. You know what? It's the same thing I get every time. It's a, a fruit bowl. It's uh, Charlie's orange juice, which I have four. It's a uh, croissant stuff, croissanty things in a, in a fatty bag. Bacon, scrambled eggs, a uh, uh, tomato, and a hash brown. <laughs> These are gonna get shorter and shorter. I can tell. It's only day four. It's only day four. Right now, I'm on my way to get tested, so I'm leaving out that door and I'm going up to the 14th floor. Um, how does this mask make me look? Does it make me look fat? Getting closer. I'm about to get tested by this wonderful person. And this is not going to, it's going to be painless, isn't it? Have you done it before? No. Because it is quite uncomfortable. All oh, right. I'm used but, to being um, uncomfortable. It's super quick. It's, it doesn't last for too long. Okay. It's probably going to make your eyes water and you can like cough or sneeze. But I think it's a bit like going upside down in a swimming pool or something like that for you. Oh, okay. Just a bit bizarre. So if you look out the window there and turn yep. your head back slightly. Okay, it's just coming out. Oh, wow. <laughs> Okay, that's all done. You okay? That is fascinating. <laughs> <laughs> that, is no, that it? it. Yeah. You okay? You yeah, I'm well. great. Do you want to be on the nose? No, I'm, I'm fine. Yeah, just one, one, one nose is good. I appreciate it. Thank you. Well, that's an experience I'll never want to repeat again. So I did it. Now I'm going downstairs to get some water. Is this a good look? I think it's a good look. I'm like a bloody nose pirate. So I went and got my uh, test and it was wonderful. They went, uh, they had a, there was a long swab. I, I always think that these tests are going to be with cotton swabs. Just like the normal ones you use for ears and your makeup. Well, not my makeup, your makeup. You, you know who you are. But it's just this long, thin uh, swab and they get it right up your nose. You t tilt your head back, as you saw, and uh, it kind of tickles your brainstem. My eyes kind of watered up a little bit, but uh, interestingly painless. Um, just awkward. But I got it done, so that's day three uh, taken care of. And now, uh, well, now the excitement begins. I'm going to do a little bit of music, I'll show you some of that. Um, I'm going to have lunch here real soon, show you that. And then, we've got to open that envelope. So, pfft, things going to just like fly by. Good things are coming my way, yo. Dark addiction starts to break Declaring there is hope and there is freedom I speak Jesus That's dope Alright kids, lunch time! What? I don't even know I don't even know First things first, what is it? You're right, it's a salad 
This one has uh, noodles in it. Noodles and one singular broccoli. Apple. Kettle corn. Actually, New Zealand, this is really, really tasty because it's just really sugary. This is a, looks like a ball of chocolatey goodness. Mm. Drumsticks, drumsticks, rice and broccoli. Chicken drumsticks. Bingo looking good. Oh, and some sweet potato. There's sweet potato at the bottom there. Do you like looking at that? Is that, is that impressive to you? So I'm going to eat my, usually if, if you're wondering how I eat, I eat my salad first. Uh, then my main, and maybe I keep these for later. Then the apple. Oh no, I keep the apple for later for sure. And then I eat the dessert. So I'm going to do that right now with my plastic ware. Uh, watch some cricket. It's Cajun chicken. I can feel the spices. Oh, it's so good. And it's just like tender and juicy. Just how a chicken leg should be. Yeah, about the right size for a chicken. I thought it was time for a change of scenery, so I'm in the bathtub. Maybe I should do a whole vlog from the bathtub, like a bubble bathtub vlog. That'd be awesome. But saying that, it's time for open that envelope. Let's do it. Open that envelope, open that envelope, here we go. Here it is, June 26th. I'm so excited, I don't know what it's gonna be, but I'm sure it's gonna be awesome. There's a note. She said she did say that she's gonna run out of notes eventually, because she got tired of writing them. Uh, for some more decor and some beautiful sounds. I like this a lot, ha ha ha. Woodshop wooden chime set. Oh, it's wooden chimes. Oh my word, here, take a look at this. I have, this is like a wood thing that I paint with my paintbrush and I paint these things and I tie it all together with these wind chimes. This is exceptional! Let's make it! <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. Voila, I have painted them. I have painted them. So I've kind of done a pretty, uh, I mean a bit of a rush job. And then I've got to put it together once it dries. So cool. Okay, this didn't work. I couldn't do this very well. Because the string, the problem that I'm having here is the string that came with it doesn't go through the holes. I got one on, but it doesn't go through the holes on the rest. So unfortunately, I have this, and this, and this, but no, the strings won't, the string won't go through. If anyone's got any idea, I don't have scissors, and I'm trying to lick and twist, but the, the, it's just so, the string's so frayed. It's just afraid not. I'm afraid not. Ha <laughs> ha! Jokes all day. Nothing, I just got a phone call. What's that all about? Where this thing just happened? Someone called me to my room and said, Someone, did you have an Uber Eats order? And I said, No. Yes, maybe I did. And they said, Yes, it's down here. So someone's ordered me Uber Eats. I'm going to find out what it is. And they were like, uh, is you, You're in room 308? And I said, Yes. And so I went downstairs and someone. I'm guessing it's Cabrera, Matt Cabrera, it has ordered me donuts from Krispy Kreme, but not just six, he's ordered me 12 donuts. I didn't know other people could order me Uber Eats. You guys better get cracking. This is so ridiculous. Oh man. Oh, jelly bill. I've got 12 donuts. They will be gone tonight because I ain't a quitter. Uh, I do. He said, you know, you forget milk in the fridge. He's been watching the vlogs. I got milk in the fridge. I love you, Cabrera. Matt, Kelsey, you beautiful people. I appreciate you. <laughs> oh, this is so great. I can't tell you how funny it was just to walk down there and go, is this mine? And he's like, I don't know. 
<laughs> I'm like, I don't know either. And he's like, you ordered it. <laughs> and just like that, it's dinner time. It seems like I just eat and eat and eat. Does it seem like that to you? Got my little bag of goodies. We start with salad. What's up? So this is a beetroot salad, looks like, uh, with some lettuce. It's even got a dangler. Looks like a, oh, that looks like a tiramisu type cake. Hmm, probably wrong about that. <laughs> Beauty! It's nothing but fish and chips, baby! Fish and chips! Fish and chips! Fish and chips! I'm gonna eat fish and chips! Fish and chips! Fish and chips! I'm gonna eat fish and chips! It's been a longer day than um, I thought it would be. But yeah, this is great. Fish and chips. I haven't had fish and chips. Now, for those of you that don't know, oh, sorry, I salt and pepper everything. For those of you that don't know, fish and chips is one of my favorite things, especially here in New Zealand. The fish and chips in New Zealand are just amazing. There's, there's nothing like it anywhere. So, you have to all come out here. You can stay at my mum's place. It'll be fine. She would love it. Then I'm gonna jump on the bed. So that's it for tonight, for today, for day four. Day four is over, it's kaput. Man, it's only day four. Day five is gonna be special. I'm gonna do some things, I think. I've gotta start branching out, because otherwise this will get super boring to watch. Maybe try to mix it up a little bit. We'll see how we go, see how I feel in the morning. Thanks for being with me on this uh, little journey of quarantine that I'm on. Good night. Right guys? Yeah, those guys are hilarious.